everybody and welcome back to Resident Evil Remastered. And in the previous episode we actually found some items and two ammo discs. So probably gonna find the area ammo disc then. Whoa! <laughs> Die already! There! Stupid zombie. He didn't even stand a chance against me with my gun. Alright, I'm gonna have to come over here. Cause there's a passcode I have to put in somewhere. I think it's cell. Okay. Hello computer, we meet it again. John and Ada. There. Now it's accessing my visual and it's specified. Okay, I'm gonna have to open up B2. Yay! There we go. Now the the room on the first floor is open. So I could always go back up there and open it. Okay, there's probably nothing up here I need. A minute. Need that battery. That could come in handy for later. I mean, never know, I may need that, right? I think those ammo discs open the little door in that one room we went in earlier. Like does the Whoa! How are you not freaking dead? Seriously. Shot you twice. Okay, I probably need a key for that one. I always have to have the big keys for everything down there. <laughs> keys for a door, keys for another door. Keys for everything. But up here. Somewhere. I thought there was something about to jump up at me. I just wasted one, one bullet on nothing. state spray that's what I need for later just in case got another ammo disc yep I don't need that thank you eight four six two sounds like easy but sometimes I end up forgetting I have to end up googling it. Okay, now I'll pick up a board tray key. Let's see what we have here. Now we can see the film that that dead guy from earlier had. I think this was when he was trying to stay, escape that zombie, but got him anyways. That don't be gone before you can even escape. Such. They have more ammo now, but I have no idea. I'll just go ahead and use this in the room. So that way I can have enough room for that. There. No. I'll just have to find another item box now. Cause I know there's gotta be an item box somewhere. Area that I'm going to do. Just hope there's not going to be any zombies again. That attack me. <laughs> this is like every time I play this game, there's always a zombie to come out and get me. I always attract the zombies. 
I don't know why, I just do. But I don't really need to go that way. Not right now. I probably go through here. And I probably have to use the ammo disc for that little area I'm going to. Crap. Can I push this this way? No? Okay, I have to see if there's anything here I need right here. Hey, at least I can put this back on. Hey, I got more shark vision shells. That'll come in handy for later. For when I really need it. That's, that's a shortcut right there. No, I can easily use this ammo disc for right here. It's funny how I can remember where the ammo disc area is. Yeah, I don't even remember other areas. And some certain things. I'm gonna push. Whoa! Look at the bug. It just came out of nowhere. Seriously, it did. Yes, I would like to discard. I probably will have to get rid of some of the bugs in the main area. Let me come down here. Let's see how much ammo I have left in that one. Then I have none in that one. So I probably will have to get my shotgun. Let me do that. Till the darn bugs are out of the way. Because from what I learned is if you shoot and run, the little capsule that you'll you'll be carrying will blow up. Put this one away and this one for now. I'll have to get this one out. I will need that. Shotgun shells, I need those. And I'll need this too. Let's see if I can reload the. Nope. It just switches out the, the shells. Alright. Probably we'll have to switch the gun over for this one. Probably will have to put the top gun in the top row away for now. At least until I get more ammo for that one. Now there's enough room. I'm gonna have to go where those parasites are. The ones that just go everywhere. And you're like, get away from me. They darn buds. It just spazzes and is like, no, I got shot. <laughs> I put her fall down and spaz up. Shaking our guard. A refueling device for the power room. Not working right now because there's no fuel. It's an empty capsule. Yes. No. I'm gonna get my foot down this way. All I'll have to do is just walk and try not to do anything that would shake it up. Cause you really gotta be careful with that. I learned my lesson with it already. <laughs> so note 
to myself and everybody else that trying to play this and never played it before. Take it from a lesson from me. <laughs> Don't run or shoot anything with the empty capsule when you fill it up. Big bad, big bad idea if you do that. I learned that the hard way. And don't run until after you put the capsule in. It's the only way. Alright, just have to go down this door here. And fill it up. Okay, I'm probably gonna have to get the zombie here. Shoot head. <laughs> That's the only way to get to not come back alive is if you like shoot it in the head, and the head just burst off. <laughs> then there you go. Okay, time to not run or shoot anything. Just have to run. I mean, walk. Like, why am I talking about running with to get me dead in this game? <sighs> to be careful with this one. The force is strong with this one. go this way and hope that there's no zombies or anything that come jumping at me <laughs> okay, I'm have to walk slowly this way yeah I made it to the door I needed to go to it's a good thing I shot that one bud monster thing Just in case if they jump at me, then I'll just keep walking until <laughs> I get to that area I need to go to. Man, this part is a pain in the butt when you have to walk. Okay, I better get over here fast. Not fast, but just walking fast. Okay, luckily there's no buds or anything that is jumping out. Okay, good. You also find the device for it's not working right now. Yes, now I can run now. Good for not coming out until now. I'm just gonna run for it. Did I really need to put that last disc ammo disc away? Now, now that should make some room. Now the final one is already done. No really. Pretty obvious game. Pretty freaking obvious. Okay, I wanna see what is behind that one door that finally unlocked. Okay, now I see it through here. So there must be something behind there, right? I think Chris is down there in the area that I finally unlocked. Probably have to go help him. I 
I don't even know how you got locked up down there to begin with. Unless someone cunt them out and just dragged them down to the cell. Yeah. I'll have to do just do one at a time. Which sucks. Why can't I just push all three at the same time? There. Now we could open it. Time to go downstairs and see Chris. Not up in the cell. <laughs> I think when you play as Chris, it'll be Jill instead. In the little cellar down here. Jill? Chris! You're alive! Of course I'm alive. Funny how Chris's Jill, looks there's something changed big going over down, the years of the games. I don't think we're part of the equation. <laughs> I have to get you out of here. Ugh, it won't open! Wait, I'll be back to get you out. Okay. No sightseeing, though. Oh, I wanted to go sightseeing. <laughs> I wanted to look around. Can I just look around for this, please? <sighs> That's what I wanted to do while he was locked down there. <laughs> just sightseeing around town. <laughs> okay, time for me to find that one place. With the typewriter. Okay, there should be... down here somewhere. Probably here. Nope. Just a dagger. Anything else? Oh, there we go. I have a feeling there was ammo somewhere. There's nothing else here that I don't need. At least until not- until later. Now we made it down this way. Okay, let's pick this up. I like how they have like the little item boxes to where you could put your items in. And then you just so I'm gonna put this with that. Now it's 200 days and move. Yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and tell it here for now. If you guys enjoyed the video, feel free to smack that like button below. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye everybody.